All right, so we know NBA 2K21 is coming to a close. There really hasn't been too much to do, but I've had this event circled on my calendar for a minute. If you guys remember last year, we did a video where we brought all my legend builds to the 1v1 court and we won a game. Today, we're gonna take it up just a notch. All of the builds that I've created this year, they're all at 99 overall. We are gonna be attempting to win a 1v1 rush event. That's four straight games with every single build that I have. The only one that we will not be using is my five foot seven slasher. Guys, it's August. This build can't even shoot that well, so I definitely don't wanna try that. But we have nine other builds that we will be using, and we're gonna win the 1v1 rush on all of them. I have not done this before. It should be a good video. It's going to be pretty long, so make sure you guys are strapped in. It's going to be a good one. If you guys do enjoy, make sure you go ahead and drop a like. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. We've got a lot of legend builds coming up until 2K22 as well. It's a lot that you haven't seen. Without further ado, let's hop into the first build, and let's win 1v1 Rush. And Middleton each scored 20 or more. Oh, my goodness. They leave him wide open. Now, I just wouldn't seem right if we didn't start with a Giannis build. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys every single one of the stats on the builds that I get on. It's been a second since we actually played on this build, and I will have this build at Legend coming out very soon, so make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Like I said, I just will show you guys everything before we hop in, the badges that we're using. It's going to be a long video. This should be the easier one. I kind of wanted to start off just a little bit easy, just kind of get a feel for the game. But let's hop into it. The 1v1 rush with Giannis. This should not take long at all. So I'm not worried about this one. It's kind of like the 6-1 build. Some of the guard builds. I feel like right now, my Giannis build, I'm not going to hop in. I'm going to play all guards. But once I get on my guards, I'm going to play all bigs. You guys already know how it goes. I also never get ball first. So let's see if this, you know, the tradition continues right here. I guarantee I don't get it. I guarantee I don't get ball first, and of course I don't. But I'm going to try to keep this kind of fast-paced because, like I said, we will be having 36 games. I don't want this to last forever. All right, we got to play. All right, this is an easy game. I haven't felt like I played on this build in a minute either. Look at that. That's why we put pickpocket on. I know some of you guys, when I was showing my badges, you're like, Dignify never runs pickpocket. This is why we do it. Hit him with a Dignify spin to start it off. First play. That never hurt anybody. We got to get a little bit of takeover. Once we get takeover up a little bit, then I'll start, you know, actually shooting mid-ranges and stuff. But, like, I don't understand, like what kind of defense he's even trying to do let's go in the post speed boost and we're out of here contact dunk we're grinning our lives though I'll take that we haven't got a single contact dunk that's kind of bad oh my that's such a pretty move when you get like clamped up like that oh my gosh <laughs> we made that there we go here's one there we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's what we needed to see. Now it'd just be perfect if we could just green a mid range. No, he's not going to leave us open. We got to make this ourselves. All right. Well, we already dribbled too much, so this is kind of a lost cause. We'll just get a contact dunk to end it. Ah, we'll take that all day. Next game, one of these games for sure, we'll green a mid range. If I dribble too much, I didn't really want to turn the ball over again, but that's game one. Wow, we actually got ball first, and it looks like we get to play against another center, which I kind of like. Oh, he's only a 74. Oh, boy. But at least he has the whole blacked out arm. At least he's got that going. We'll just take him baseline. See, look. <laughs> told you bro it's like i understand it just because you can't shoot consistently but like come try to at least play some defense Let's see if we can get him jumping off this oh wow he didn't jump Let's see if we get him out of euro oh my dude that is just that is just so pretty they try to jump out of dunks you know just hit him with some finesse but this time we'll go straight there and dunk it on him hey there's no way <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah man we can do the same thing <laughs> well we actually know how to do it all right this is gonna be a straight up contact dunk to the left too i play too much 1v1 court man i know i'm gonna get a contact dunk right here like i just know let's hop step him there you go stun him too left hand Giannis. i like it walk it up green in it that's all that matters we green the mid range let's go baby that's game two, too, so we're 2-0, oh, pretty easy. You know, like I said, I wanted to get a little bit warmed up before we got into some of the more difficult builds. All right, now I'm expecting some pole scores. You know, a lot of pole scores go 3-0, so we'll see what we get right here. Oh, it's a slashing playmaker, too. Okay, I will be bringing my slashing playmaker out here, and you guys will see how I shoot. If I know anything, if this guy, unless he's like a pure yellow, he cannot shoot either. Oh, we're, we're post. We can play in the post, too. You know, we will be bringing the post score back out here eventually. 
Hey! Oh my gosh, that dunk was nasty. Like now he want now he wants to press up. But if he press up, you see him spamming too. We'll just go right by him. Oh, there's no. Oh, that'd have been so. Why did I miss that though? That'd have been so nice getting him jumping to the left and then doing like a contact dunk when he came back down. Come on. <laughs> That's too funny. Hit him with a spin dunk. Oh. Oh my gosh, that was so good. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Where was I throwing that to? Hey, two hands for safety. That's That was the easiest game, and that was game three, right? One more. The Giannis feel like I said, it's probably the most overpowered. It's gonna be the easiest one. So I know I can't get my hopes up. Wow. There is just no way that we got ball three straight times it's a not this is so random it's just like a random 91 all-star two for the last game but he's probably like watch he'll probably be crazy i'll turn the ball over I, oh, <laughs> he kind of played pretty good on that i don't know how to get contact on though here he goes i think i've gotten that animation like twice we'll hit him with a spin right here behind the back Oh my gosh, bro. You can't even stay in front of me. You can't get mad. You legit can't even stay in front of me. Oh my gosh. That was so nice, man. That was so nice. Yeah, that's an easy one. That's an easy one. That's what we like to see. That was the easiest 4-0 gameplay I've ever seen. I'm telling you, man. Me and the Giannis feels a scary side. I can't wait for like what I can say I can make on 2K22. All right, that's four straight W's on the Giannis field. Let's go ahead and get into the next one. Kyrie against Brian, who takes on the challenge. See if Kyrie does as well. Crowd anticipating a little one-on-one -on -one action. Behind the back, couldn't shake him. Brian still an all-world defender, and he blocked it. Here comes Brian, open floor against Kyrie. Puts it down, he's fouled. Tip it. Bryant with the save. Oh, you gotta get a shot here. Final seconds. Bryant for the win. Bang! Bryant goes to work. Bryant the drive. Oh! Kobe Bryant on a rock attack. All right, so y'all know for the next one, we had to bring out the Kobe Bryant build. This is actually, I think, the first build that I made. So I'm gonna show you guys the stats on this one real quick. 86 driving dunk, you guys know. The three-pointers there. Speed boosting. Pretty decent defense. And, you know, really good speed and stuff. I'll show you guys the badges real quickly. This is what I will be using. Because I know a lot of people are going to ask after the C gameplay what badges I use. You got to remember, this is for the 1v1 court. And the only thing that's kind of bad about this build, we only have six defensive badges. So this could be a liability. Oh, wow. We, I mean, we don't get ball first. But at least we get to go against another guard. And I know my Kobe might look a little scuffed. I was using Froby face scan. And I just took off the hair and changed the beard. So I don't know if they have like, different face creations. Oh, brother. I'm sorry, man. We're going to have to do it to you. There we go. That's why we that's why we rock ankle breaker. Look at that. That's pretty. Man, it's like on defense, I just feel like I'm not like in control at all. There you go. You can't leave me open though, man. Don't be disrespectful now. Oh my gosh. I, this build, I swear, for some reason it just gets more contact dunks than my Giannis build does. Like, look how many dunks it gets. If we make a three right here, I do believe we'll get taken. He's just letting me shoot it too. And I already got green machine going, so I'm just setting myself up for failure. Oh, he made a white though. He can't complain. He made a white too. Like, look. And when they do that, it feels like, oh my God. <laughs> Sit down, bro. Yeah, I gotta hold it. I gotta hold it like just a little bit longer. That back in the corner for game? Sure. Oh my gosh, <laughs> this build, bro. I told you at the beginning of the year, if you guys watch my content, I felt like I could never like shoot with this build. I don't know if they made it easier or the badges got better. Or I got better at the game, but man, this build is good. Licky walk. <laughs> All right, we're gonna have to take our easy buckets because this guy's actually good and it's hard to guard these guards on here. I'm not gonna lie. Oh my gosh, that's so beautiful. I love ankle breaker too. I don't care if it's overpowered. <laughs> Come on, baby. Like, bro, ankle breaker is so good. <laughs> Look at, oh my gosh. Yeah, I feel like I'm gonna get blocked on one of these, but as of right now, we're looking pretty good. 
two. Oh my gosh, I just dunk everything on this build. It's crazy. Get out of the paint, man. Come up and guard me. <laughs> Even if you think you can time that, you can't. You can't time it. <gasps> oh my. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Oh my gosh, with bronze rim protector, we just snatch blocked it. <laughs> that's that's too much, man. All right, we get ball first. Oh, brother, a post score. He doesn't even look that tall, though. Maybe, hopefully, it's just like a build that has post take. A facilitating finisher with post take. Bro, it's the shooting in here. It's like I'm scared to shoot the ball because of the delay in here, man. Well, he has post score and takeover. It's time to be careful with the ball. And like I said, I can't shoot because he'll leave me wide open. And I can't make a shot for some reason. Take a page out of his book and go to the post real quick. Little drop step action. That was risky. <laughs> That's risky to go up against the big and try to do a contact dunk like that. Let's go, come on. All right, we got sharpshooting takeover. Theoretically, we should be able to shoot, so let's see what happens. I'm gonna shoot this wide open one. <laughs> I'm getting bailed out, bro. Let's go. Can't leave me that open that many times. <laughs> it wasn't pretty. This is like the motto of the channel. Might not be pretty, but if it gets the job done, it gets the job done. A pole score taken out. You know, we didn't shoot the best right there. One for two for three. We didn't shoot that much. But one more game to go. Not too bad for a guard. Why do I just feel like it's... I don't know what it is. I had a feeling about the paint beast, but I have a feeling this is about to be a seven foot three. Just like pure inside build right here. <sighs> Interior finisher with slashing takeover. This will be fun. Make him, make him do something. Okay, you made that one. And that's where you sell, man. Let's go, come on. Don't sit in the pain though, bro. We can shoot the ball too. Like, I'm not gonna be afraid to shoot. Like, if you're just gonna sit down there. Oh my gosh. Bro, some of these dunks, I feel like I'm about to get blocked. I gotta start going up on the analog stick. Oh my gosh, get out of the pain, little guy. Oh my gosh, look at that defensive sequence. Hey, oh, what a tough, that's Kobe all, that's got Kobe written all over it. What a tough take. All right, so let's green a mid-range right here. I just feel, I just feel comfortable with greening a mid-range right here. And then we're gonna green the three because we got takeover. If I just called this out, I just might be the best. We're gonna end with the spin back too. Oh my gosh, let's go. I did not, this is not a good shooting performance for me. Like I said, in the 1v1 court videos, we get the job done. We stopped this guy a few times too. And he's an interior force who made it pretty much to the very end. So I'll take that all day long. The Kobe build, four straight wins. Let's go ahead and get to the next one. All right, so we're back. We took a little bit of a break, but we've got one of my favorite builds all year long. I made this very early on. You guys seem to really enjoy it. We've got the Larry Bird Stretch 4 build. Let me show you guys the stats real quickly. Like I said, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys everything. All my builds are at 99 overall. These are the badges that I'm using. You got to remember, this is the 1v1 rush. So this is what I'm going to be using. Hopefully, you know, we don't have too much of a problem on this build because it can dunk. It can shoot very well. So this should be a lot of fun. Oh yeah, speaking of Trey Young, let's see if I can remember to put this in here while I'm editing. Go watch this video. Just uploaded it a few days ago. Legend Trey Young, we went crazy. You're gonna wanna see it. Look, he's got the Hawks banner and everything. Okay, I kind of respect it. Go into the post. See if we can fade first play. Look, gotta be careful though, because these guards, it's still gonna be hard to guard them. That's Larry Legend, baby. Let's go, come on, that's what we needed right there. We gotta make sure we can get a three. If it's not, it was looking bad. This build can also dunk though, so you gotta be careful how you play it.
There we go. That's pretty. Can we get a takeover? I feel like we can get takeover kind of easily, though. Oh, my gosh. Look how strong this build is. Now we got takeover. He's got to be a little bit of a bully real quick. Euro. Hop. Lay. Let's go. Not bad. We got a guard first play, which is nice. Like, I feel like this build can actually play against everybody pretty easily. But what do we shoot? Two for five for three. You got to remember some of the threes I took. I really was like two for three. I did some like step backs and stuff. But first game on the Larry Bird build. First time ever on the 1v1 court. We'll take it. Oh, <laughs> my God. What a block. Nah, we're still here, man. You got to do better than that. Why is he leaving me wide open like I don't have a 92 three-pointer? Like, what's going on here? Now, nah, we got to end this kind of special, though. Dude, every single one of those, I'm pretty sure, was white. <laughs> That's crazy. But this kid, after he got stopped first play, he just gave up. Like I said, we can't control it. We'll take the W on to the next one. Now right, we got a we got a glass cleaner. Okay, cool. Nah, it's not that easy, my boy. Not that easy, my boy. You gotta close out quick. Bro, I've been greening. I've been not greening anything. This is bad. I'm telling you, it's the 1v1 rush. It's delayed. Let me know, guys. I think I've said it already. Let me know. Is this delayed in here? Like anybody that's shooting, is it feel as delayed? <laughs> if you guys watched my post score video, I found out if people ever drop step, just spam. You're going to get like the ball 99% of the time. There we go. Now we got to get our timing down. It's, that's another challenge of this. I don't even think I mentioned it. Like I'm switching builds and different like jump shots and everything every single time. So it's a little bit of a challenge. We're Larry Bird, baby. <laughs> so nice, man. I love this build so much. Nah, you can't leave me open now. I got too much green machine going. You're going to have to get out of here on the island. Oh my gosh, if we're dunking like that. <laughs> Bro, that's too easy. I didn't, sh dude, I'm not shooting well in here though. I think I have 100% speed on. That might be the problem, but you know, 3 0, we can't complain. The motto of the video is for getting the job done. All right, he's an interior finisher. This is like, if he plays how I think he is, this shouldn't be that bad. There we go. We finally get one green. Look at what we're shooting. We're shooting 20% on a pure stretch. That goes to show you something. I think this kid gave up too. Or he probably just thinks I'm going to miss. I don't really blame him. But I make, that's, that's what I make. I can make a fading three from like Uganda. But okay. No way this kid has gave up. That's so annoying, bro. Like, come on, man. Like, why would you go to the very end and just give up? <laughs> Larry Bird throwing self alley oops off the backboard. He gave up for a second and then came back, but bro, I shot so poorly. I think from this point going forward, I'm gonna have to put on the shot meter, but we got four W's on the stretch big. Let's go ahead and get to the next one. Now, speaking of builds I have not played on in a long time, I'm trying to switch it up between builds that can shoot and builds, you know, that are more focused towards the dunks, but we're on my Zion Williamson two-way finisher. Like I said, I have not brought this build out in a long time. This is what it looks like. We got a good driving dunk. Pretty good strength. Some people are saying he should have a higher strength, but it's whatever. But look at the defensive stats. Like, very, very solid. This is what the bad is. I'm just going to go through it. Like I said, I'm going to try to play a little bit more traditional. More towards the back, towards the basket. And maybe, you know, bully some of these guards that we go up against. See if we can bully some centers as well. And then, of course, we can't really shoot. So, that doesn't really matter. We've got an ankle breaker, which will always be fun. And then, we've got a ton of defensive badges. Wow. He stopped that. But we're big Zion, baby. Let's go. <laughs> Let's see if we can get him with this. <laughs> That's worth keeping it. That's disgusting. All right, so this is what we've been waiting for. We have slashing takeover. I feel like on one of these builds, I have to get like a jump over animate. Oh my, yeah, that's what we wanted. That's what we wanted to see from Zion. <gasps> was that supposed to be? I, For some reason, I just feel like that was supposed to be the jump over animation. Bro, 
I'm not gonna lie, that was probably the most annoying game I've ever played in my life. The dude just did ankle breakers the whole entire time and just run ran. He, like shot, what, two threes? <sighs> Sometimes it'd be like that. I, dude, I would have actually been so mad if I lost that game. Bro, now that I think about it though, play shots might be the easiest build to use on every single court. Yes, sir, another playmaking shot creator. <laughs> You're basically just asking to get dunked on when you don't even try to press me up here. I think that's why I didn't have ankle breaker on because most people will play defense like this. So like it didn't matter because they never pressed up. He just, is he just asking to get po- Oh my, dude, I don't think I've ever had this animation. I think I was supposed to like step over him or bro. <laughs> that dunk was insane. <gasps> I jumped over him. <laughs> No way I actually got the jump over animation. Let's go. <laughs> All right, so we had two play shots, but even though like obviously just running and dunking like that, it's like, it's okay. But the fact that we got some crazy animations, bro, the jump over animation, that's just wild. Look, it's literally just ankle breaker. That's why, I don't, okay, this is why I can't feel bad at just dunking the ball every time. It's ankle breakers into just rim running. Oh my gosh, he's contact dunks. Yep, I'm just rim running now, I don't care. I might even bully this guy. Get out of my way. <laughs> Get out of my way. We were almost anything off take too. He's not expecting drop steps though. He's not expecting those quick drop steps. He's expecting it if I do it for a long time. Come on, bro. Like I'm, yeah, I, yeah. You didn't shoot a single three this whole game, bro. Bro, that was so pretty. This kid, not one time did he shoot a three. He shot one three and I think it was like by accident. All he did was stun and rim run. That's why you can't feel bad if you have to do stuff like this to win a game. We got one more. But we had three play shots in a row. That's kind of weird. <laughs> X moving. Oh my god. Bro, my finger slipped and I tried to do the spin too. <laughs> I'm just toying with this guy. The last game too. Don't worry, we'll get it right back. I played too much 1v1 core, buddy. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. Oh, bro, I thought this was gonna be boring, but this might be one of the best gameplays for all four games that we've gotten. Let's see how far I can just shoulder charge this guy. I know he's gonna go directly into the paint, but let's see. And then we get the standing dunk. That's just beautiful. Let's go. All right, 22 to zero, but it was weird. Four play shots. You don't see that very often. Maybe you'll get a couple, but four play shots. We won four straight games. Was that four builds now? So let's go ahead and get into the next one. All right, so now I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I'm talking about, how easy it is to win on a build like this. We're on my Devin Booker build. I'll show you guys. This is probably one I've used pretty frequently. Um, recently, actually, I've been using this build and it's pretty good all around. We got a 93 pointer and 92 mid range, so we should be able to shoot. Here are the badges. It's gonna go through this real quickly. Not gonna spend time on it. I just know you guys are gonna ask. You know, they always people always ask, so this is what I'm gonna be using in the video. But we also do have meter on because I just feel like it's delayed in here, so at least I can see the timing of my shots. Don't try to go too much one way. I'm gonna get my shot off. Let me find out this. Dude, you guys can see in that meter, bro. It just feels like it's really delayed. I don't know, it might just be me. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's really just get an ankle breaker and then just shoot or rim run, whichever one. <laughs> it's so easy. Dude, this build is so easy to use. I'll see if we can do some spin shots. You know, my videos have been kind of using meter recently. Oh my gosh, that's green too. We're green at everything. Yeah, this guy just gave up. I don't blame him. I don't blame him. It's too easy. I'm telling you, this like shot creator play shot type of build in the 1v1 court, it's so easy to use. People don't believe me when I say it, but like, 
I honestly think this is easier to use than like a Giannis build or like a Paint Beast at least. Oh my gosh, we gotta stop first play. We really got a first play stop against the Paint Beast. All right, let's lock it. Let's go, come on. Let's go, come on. It's easy. These guys are slow. You got to think. I know how to play on the Giannis build, and this is basically what this guy is. He might be a little bit quicker, but... <laughs> this kid is so bad. Literally just post spinning the whole entire time. Anyway, get off my court. That's a pain beast taken down on the shot creator build. It was a close game because he was just booking, you know, backing me down and all that. But we had to do our thing. The shot creator got the job done. I'm telling you, the play shots are easy to use. Oh my! All right, this I don't I don't care. I'm not redoing this. This guy lagged out. I can't make it up. You guys know the motto of the video. It might not have to be the prettiest thing. We don't care how it gets done, but we get the job done. Three W's in a row. Let's go ahead and get to this last game. Bro, how did this guy make it to the last game? You guys can see the W's in the background. This guy made it to the last game. I don't know. I'm just getting lucky, I guess. Oh, no. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry it had to end this way. I know you're probably asking for the W, but, man, I'm sorry. Why is he just letting me shoot, bro? I'm not going to miss. I have meter on. I actually can time the shots now. <laughs> I'm so, dude, I just don't know how he made it to the last round. I feel bad, but brain. <laughs> bro, what do we we got so lucky? We played this guy and then we played an AI. Bro, I'm telling you, like I don't I can't control it. It's matchmaking. i this is my first go through with this build. I'm telling you, the play shot, the shot creators type of builds are easy to use. We got four W's. I think that's five builds, four more to go. Let's go again to the next one. All right, so we took a little bit of a break. We're back on the Bowl Bowl build, and we've got about four more builds left. Let me show you guys. If you haven't seen this build, it's at 99 overall right now. It's pretty good. You know, it's not like the best build or anything like that, but Bowl Bowl was always a favorite, so we had to make sure we made it. These are the badges. Nothing too crazy. Again, I always just like to say I like to show these because I know a lot of people are going to be asking. All right, man, let's go ahead and get into it. Yeah, we got a glass cleaning finisher. That's what the majority of people... Oh, you kind of hit that thing, though. <laughs> it wouldn't surprise me if I missed that. I'm like doing everything I can right now to score. But dude, I, I don't know how many steals I've gotten. <laughs> I've gotten so I've gotten three steals, and I have not been able to hit a jump shot to save my life. Let's go. <laughs> it's possible. We can green. Like all these feel good. They're just not going in for me right now. Oh, that's a deep three right there. There you go, bowl. We might be shooting 20%, but we'll take it. He's gonna keep leaving us open. I'm locked in now. I like I said, I just gotta see one go in. I gotta, you know, I'm locked. <laughs> Come on, that's three in a row. We'll take that three, threes in a row to end it. It wasn't pretty to start it off, but like I said, I get green machine going. I see a couple go in. I get warmed up, and now we're talking. Oh my gosh, that was pretty. Bro, this build's getting a ton of steals. Bro, that was probably one of the cleanest moves I've done on this build. Oh. <laughs> my Dirk. Dang it, we, man, we're out of takeover. We had to dunk it, that's tough. We didn't even get to make a three. We tried to hit the one-legged three, it didn't work out, but two and oh. Three blocks. There we go, come on. Bro, I love that little drop step when they, that's it. <laughs> you gotta love when you can utilize everything in your game. Three point shots, knocking them down, finally get the timing right. 
Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's what we like to see. Slash. Oh, my gosh. This sharp take is crazy. Yeah, don't jump. Come on. <laughs> Clutch shooter. Bro, this build, man. It's the shooting on this game. I shot two for two from three, so that's not bad. We have four blocks. This kid just drove in and got some of the luckiest animations. Good game to you. But that's going to be 3 0 in the Bull Bull build. Last game, please. I hope it's not a play shot. Oh, yeah. This is, yeah. Bro, we already just made this kid go 0 for 4. Yeah, he's not getting takeover for a long time. Pro. <laughs> I'm so glad that barrier was there. I was trying to go behind the back and do like a reverse lay, but it actually worked out. Get in there. Corner specialist. It's a two, but we'll take it. Let's go. That's a big three with 33%. Was it one for three right now? We got a little bit left. Can we get one more off? Yes, we can, baby. Let's go just in time. Crabbed. <laughs> I try to throw it. But I guess my build can't throw self lobs. And I just made the closest shot I've probably ever have done in my life. We end up winning that game. Not bad. That's four straight games on the bowl bowl build. It was a lot of fun. I haven't played this build in the 1v1 court before. I'm glad we did. Let's go on to the last three builds. Now, I wanted to do this build next because I honestly think it's going to be the most difficult, even probably more difficult than any of my like small slashers. I only think this build is going to be hard it's because we don't have the height. We are six foot one. I'm going to show you guys the build real quickly. We do have the jump shot. We got the three ball and all that good stuff. Park dunks, 99 speed, the great defense, good badges, you know. But like I said, we're six foot one. If we go up against anybody, unless we get like a great steal animation, it's going to be very tough. To get some stops on this build now i'm trying to get guys like this i want play shots every single time i'm not gonna lie there you go you get why is it, why would he leave this build open i don't understand that at all <laughs> i really be slasher made now that i think about it that's crazy just get ankle breakers and dunk it that's all you have to do ankle breakers and dunk now he's not gonna guard me Let's go. Come on. Let's see if he steps up for game real quick. I got to make sure I can drop him, bro. I'm, I might just have to try it regardless. Eh. We'll just take it. I don't care. I don't care enough to. He wasn't playing the greatest defense on ball, so I had to just make sure I got the W. I'm not trying to sit here forever. If the opportunity comes if somebody's pressing me once I have play take, their ankles will be taken. Let's go. Come on. Just got to get the mid-range to drop, bro. And then I can just get open and shoot threes. But right now... <laughs> when in doubt, dignify spin it out. I'm not gonna lie to you. No, why did it just give me? <laughs> it just gave me the slowest animation. He fell, and I still got the dunk off. I love it. Come on, that's what we needed. That's exactly what we needed, and we got take. <laughs> There's no way we're doing this right now. Dude, there's just no way this is actually working. And wh <laughs> what is going on right now? What am I doing on this build? Foul and one hop stepping against a two-way slashing playmaker that's way taller than I am. I would be so mad. I can't believe we just won the game that way. I'm moving probably as poorly as I ever have before. It's currently 11 o'clock at night. I'm just wanting to get these last two W's because I know for sure this is probably gonna be the hardest build to get it done. Simple movements, get the job done. That's all we're asking for. Why is he leaving me open? Like I can't shoot. Like that's so disrespectful, bro. I know I missed the first one, but you gotta come guard me. I will shoot. I will make all these. I will say that right now. I will make all these on this build. You better come out here and guard me, bro. Oh my gosh. Come on, bro. <laughs> bro, it's like he has no interior or any defense at all. I'm not even going to waste my time. If you want to sit paint, you can sit paint. Get off my court, my guy. We win that one 23 to 5. Pretty easy. Against an 83 overall paint beast with black forces. So. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh my gosh, I am slasher made. Give me that reverse. Let's go. There you go. Come on. Oh my gosh, that's how we do it around here, man. Oh my gosh. There's no way. Oh my god, there's no way I just hit that shot, bro. I don't care. This is just meant to be. This, this game is just meant to be right now. Let's go! I can't believe we just did that, bro. I cannot believe we just did that. That was an intense game. It's very hard to use this build in the 1v1 rush. I'm not gonna lie. It's six foot one. It doesn't move the fastest because we don't have the Hall of Fame badges. But, hey, we got the job done. Four Ws, and on my opinion, the hardest build to use. We got two more left. Which one we got going next? All right, now we have two more builds left, and we had to bring out this Playmaking Slasher. This build gets a lot of heat because it's not the most well-rounded. It's got a 73 ball and a 78 mid-range. We can somewhat hit, I wouldn't even say consistently, but this is the stats right here. You guys know this build on 2K20 was amazing this year. Eh, not so much. Here are the badges. Again, just wanted to show you guys real quickly. Um, yeah, the 1v1 court on the playmaking slasher. Hopefully this goes according to plan. Oh wow, <laughs> this is kind of weird. We get a playmaking slasher against a playmaking slasher. Come here, little boy. I think low-key was good last time I used it. Yeah, that's not bad. I feel like I can hit kind of consistently with that. That's not bad at all. Let's go. We get slash take now, too. Let's see if we can get some nice contact on animations now. Hey! All right, well, here's the mid-range. Maybe try another one, so we'll see if we can greet it, bro. Yeah, we'll take it right there. I try to shoot three pointers. I try to shoot some mid ranges. We made a couple middies, didn't green anything, but this run we will at least hit one green three pointer and one green mid range. I'm not promising it, but we're gonna try. <laughs> I like it. They can be a believer. See, there we go. There's a green mid range. I promised. Yeah, there we go. Don't. Oh wow. That's a, that's a Russell Westbrook take right there. I don't know if I have his layups on, but that looks like it. Oh my gosh, that's two? Let me find out. We do have a 78, so it's nothing crazy, but the ability, the fact that we're actually making these is kind of funny. Oh, we actually get to use the ankle breaker and the contact hug, okay. <gasps> oh my God. Right when the takeover went out, we jumped over him. That's the second jump over in one video. You guys have to drop a like, especially if you're this far in the video, you have to drop a like for that. <laughs> Bro, you really can't mess around on this game because it's so easy to score. Oh my gosh. I, I would have been so mad if we lost that though. But we ended up winning. It wasn't pretty, but we got the job done, like I said. We're getting blessed. We got ball first, and we got a drippy face scan, so we probably should have turned it over. Mmm, throw that back then, Russell. Pause. Give me that. We get the chase down and we get that. Let's go, baby. All right, let's see if we can make this three right here. Oh, is that a three? Let's go. I told you, we will make a three-pointer with Russell Westbrook build. I promised we got mid-ranges, we got three-pointers, jump over animations. This isn't just your regular playmaking slasher. All right, looks like we got our last game. I think this might be a play shot. Got in with the hop steps first. This is a play shot, you gotta remember. I know it's like he's a little guard, but he's a play shot. His defense is not good. He's got like no interior defense either, so I feel like I can just make any layup that I want to, to be honest. See if we can get him to jump at least one time. It's always funny doing that to people. And then going back and dunking on him. <laughs> he fell for it again. And then he got dunked on that time. Come on, bro. <laughs> I love when play shots of all okay, I understand if you're like a lockdown or maybe if you're a center, but like a play shot sitting in the paint makes no sense to me. Like if I was this guy, I'd be like pressing up every time. 
Let's do it again. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's just the kill, bro. 22 to 4 for the fourth game in a row. You guys can see the three W's in the background. We've got one more build left. And then we're finally done. All right, so we had to come back the next day. We just finished the slashing playmaker and it was like 2 a.m. So I'm back. The last build that we have left is the interior force taco fall build. Now I've done a couple videos on this recently. So I, that's why I decided to do it last. If you guys missed the legend one and you guys missed my other one, I've done on the 1v1 court of the stage. We've had this build at legend. Like I said, make sure you go check that out. But for everybody that's new, this is what this build looks like. It is at 99 overall. Like I said, great post fade, good post moves pretty good inside stats as well we did the mostly green pie chart for this so we only get the gold sh finishing badges which isn't really too bad but but the hall of fame shooting right here is really really good and like i said this is really all that we need for a post score regardless so this is gonna be the last one taco fall let's go ahead and get into it all right enough messing around yeah we're done messing around we're gonna go into the post this guy's just sitting in the paint i don't know why like Whenever I play like a post score and I'm on like a guard or something, I always try to press them and try to steal the ball. Like, I don't know why you would just go sit directly under the paint first try every time. Maybe that's why. <laughs> I prob I promise you I would have quit if that went in and it was against me. Hop. Hey, finish left hand, not in time to get right. But bro, this build, I will get a three pointer off. We'll do something good. We'll play some centers, which will make it more fun, but the guard was too easy. You probably haven't shown too many highlights of it, but that's game one. <laughs> Imagine doing that on a full score and actually getting blown by. Oh, <laughs> that's big taco fall. I love when I get the contact dunks like that. Like, I actually get the standing dunks. All right, so that could have gone down in history for the most boring game I've ever played in my life. So we're just going to keep it here. We won 2-0. Probably won't show many highlights of it, but two down. Pro. <laughs> Was that three blocks in a matter of like 30 seconds? I feel like we can. There it is. There's one. I'm telling you, the mid range is actually kind of consistent on this build. I don't know. It's just in here is not as consistent. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We're moving now. He's probably like, what on earth? He's definitely like, what on earth did I just get myself into? And we green the fade to end it. That's beautiful. That might be one of my best game plays ever on this post score. We missed two shots. We made a three pointer. That guy went 0 for 5. Won three in a row. Let's just knock out this last one. <laughs> Bro, I can always tell like when these guards dribble too much, when just to leave them open. Like, I guarantee his meter was small. For some reason in here is always like that. Uh, two, I'm sorry, man. Like I said, I know we got three guards right there, but that third gameplay I think was really good. And I can't really do much about it. And I can't reiterate this enough. If you guys have missed the other post score videos that I've done, I've done a couple in the past like week and a half or two. Definitely go check those out. They're really good. But we won four straight. That's every single build besides the playmaking slasher, our little 5 7. But we won the 1v1 rush on every single build well hopefully you guys enjoyed the video i think this is probably one of the best videos i've done all year long it definitely was a step up from what we did last year winning the 1v1 rush on every single build if you guys are new to the channel make sure you drop a like and subscribe and check out one of these videos and until next time it's been your boy dignified i'm out peace